What up guys, Andre here with the Vault Pro Scooters to give you guys a quick review of the new 2016 Phoenix lineup. This is the Phoenix Sequel. No, it's a sequel. Let's start with the colors. So it tells me right here, it comes in four colors. We have gunmetal, black with a raw clamp, black on black with a gold clamp, and it says it comes in blue as well as a, well blue and chrome, sorry, and black and chrome. So today we're unboxing the gunmetal and raw. Alrighty, so as you can see, comes pretty packaged. Um, when we ship these out, we throw a little bit more packaging in here, but it has all the main points of contact with some foam over it so you don't have to worry about, you know, it scratching or anything like that, which is great. Comes with some tools as well. That is taped up. So you get a five mil and a six mil Allen key, as well as a little wrench, I believe maybe a uh, like 13 mil uh, lock nut, which is what comes on this scooter. Wow, this deck feels like a beast. They really wanna make sure you don't scratch this in the process of shipping. And now I'm a little annoyed, because it doesn't wanna come off. Start off like any other normal scooter check would be. Start off with the grips, Phoenix grips, just their standard grips, their newer design. Um, these are more of a harder grip than like softies are, so if you like the harder grip, boom, you found a pair. Got these uh, Phoenix Lineage Bars. They come 24 wide by 26 high. These are oversized, so they, as you can tell, we're gonna be riding HIC with the Phoenix Smooth Double Clamp. And like I said, since it is HIC, same thing as any other HIC, it ever gets loose, tighten that bolt and you're good to go. There's actually a really cool thing to see on a complete is six mil bolts for the clamp. Phoenix integrated headset. Um, Phoenix headsets have been pretty good since they started making headsets. I've never had a problem with mine. I've been running it for like three, four months now and no problems at all. They have a different, uh, different style fork. This is a 661 alloy fork. Looks like it's only 110 millimeter uh, compatible, so no 120s if you guys ever want to switch wheels. But honestly, I don't see why you would. These wheels are pretty dope. These uh, F8 wheels by uh, by Phoenix, of course. 87A uh, urethane as well, so a nice, a pretty great compound. The actual deck itself is 21 long by 4.75. So I'm gonna, I'm honestly gonna qualify this as a street riders deck. Um, I like the dimensions myself. 4.75 for other kids who don't like five wide decks, and this is actually a great width for a complete, especially a $250 complete, which is pretty low for the stuff you get on this complete. This is definitely gonna be a great scooter for this year, especially in the 2016 lineup. Give props to Phoenix for this. And um, if you have any questions, you feel like I may have missed something on this review, let me know. Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube for sure, YouTube for sure, and uh, just call us at the vault if you want to. You know, we get bored sometimes. No, we don't, we're pretty busy all the time now. But uh, until I see you next time, guys, I'm out. I'm gonna go to sleep. Bye.